Good morning guys, it's YouTube Dad here. I thought I'd come out first thing this morning, show you what I've managed to do with the uh, the garden, with the sunshade, sunscreen, whatever you want to call it. Uh, show you what I've got set up. I ended up buying a garden wheel through Amazon and it is a 40% sunshade. It's a 13 by 10 foot. Uh, I'll put a link below check out the description it'll be in there as reasonable price uh, and it covered exactly what I had uh, it was pretty much to the T used it some zip ties stretch it over the cage that I had built check it out let me know what you think I think it looks great considering it cost me probably I don't know, 25 bucks for the entire thing it's gonna save my plants too much direct sunlight on my plants during the day it's killing the tomatoes it's ruining a lot of the other vegetables not happy with that it's not good to have direct sunlight on these things it'll dry them out oh and good news i got my first ikebon eggplant growing um it's already producing a uh, vegetable for me and i will show that in this video too just a quick little tidbit all right guys let's take a look at this sunshade and tell me what you think here it is guys up and ready already blocking the sun this early florida morning i used some zip ties leftover pvc pipe i did have to adjust how far it is it slid it has to slide over just to reach the 10 foot um, but this is how it looks on the inside it's already making a difference costs about 15 bucks for all of it Use some home aluminum piping, some leftover PVC pipe that I had. Uh, everything in here is looking fairly decent, fairly happy. Had to trim back my um, tomatoes a good bit just because they had looked like early blight. So fertilized, still producing some vegetables on the uh, tomato plant, still new growth growing. So we'll keep an eye on that. The watermelon is just going crazy. It's from there. This is one plant all the way down coming out right here and growing up through that area got cilantro got my potatoes got some strawberries i moved those got my arugula carrots growing great over there i have my bell peppers three of them in a row they're producing great bell peppers actually there's the butt of one right there little guy right there and got another one going on this one looks like a little baby lizard right there too yeah eat the bugs buddy all right and then my poor little tomato plant there it's getting new growth though so the ikebon first time growing the ikebon um, japanese eggplant that's a mouthful um, so i have trimmed the lower leaves keeps doing little sprouts i'll trim those up but these are flowers that you get and they drop down they're gorgeous looking little purple flowers very nice teardrop looks and then they turn into this guy so he'll grow about eight inches long and I will pluck that and have my first oh that one actually fell off they're very fragile very delicate I'm uh, not sure if this one will produce a new limb or what but I'm not gonna mess with them again anyhow got a lot of little sprouts from it I've had this thing for a week one week had no flowers on it it's already flowering and producing fruit check them out check out the flavors that's how you spell the name of it right there ikebon type japanese eggplant that's how they look when they're fully grown all right guys let me know what you think about that all right everyone that's it for this video i'm going to go ahead and uh, i've already fertilized i'm going to water it in and I'm going to keep an eye on these things. I'm going to let you know how it does. I'm going to do more videos to show the progress, see if there is a difference with this sunshade. Link below on the sun, uh, sunshade and pricing. Um, I have nothing to do with the pricing on it or anything. It's not even my product. I don't have any products. I just do videos to talk to you guys. In the meantime, like and subscribe. Like I said, I'm doing this for my kids, growing these vegetables for my kids, teaching them how to garden. Uh, I'll do some videos of them planting some pumpkin seeds that I just got in. I use park seed. I got pumpkin seeds in. I'll do a video of them helping plant. And we're going to have some fun with this. It's going to be a good time. All right, guys, like and subscribe. Stay cool and let it grow.